what's going on guys? Carl here, back with another episode. Chilling, of course, in Vancouver, British Columbia. If you're kind of joining from when I just shot my tech travel pack, I am here for a BMW autonomous driving event. There would be no greater thrill than to sit in a car, have it drive itself, and I could catch up on emails, do social, just get work done, especially when you're sitting in traffic. Don't get me wrong, driving is still a lot of fun. I love to drive. It would just be cool to have the option to do either. Three events today to get to, and this is my cool experience. So we've landed at the first event, and I am just astonished how sunny it is. It's an X-Drive event, and I think we'll be on this little course down here. I kind of saw it when I was driving over. All registered up, and if you guys didn't know, the new M5 has X drive, so you can grab that. We're gonna be, as I said, on this little circuit here. Burn some rubber, have some fun, and there's nothing wrong with going quick in a parking lot. My favorite time now in the X3, this is the M package. This is the one that I reviewed a couple months ago. We're hopefully gonna knock over a few pylons and owe BMW some money here. Good, cool. So definitely BMW, I owe you some money after that one. <laughs> I think those were knocked over already, let's just say that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely are Totally. Yeah. Just heading out of the X-Drive event, got some cool BMW swag, and on to autonomous driving. So one of the coolest little things in level two, once I get, I guess, both dashes or both little things activated, you can actually take your hands off the wheel for say 50 seconds at a time and let the car do its thing. It'll sense if say there's a car in front of you, it will actually gauge where the lines are in the road. And for 50 seconds, like I said, you are hands-free, super useful in traffic. In Toronto, you people know how horrible the traffic is there. Game changer. So great little example here of maybe my favorite piece of tech. This is the self-parking with, of course, the little remote. It's a bit of a tight spot. So say, for example, I want to start this guy up, remove it out of the parking spot on its own. I can simply tap on the key. Now connecting. Engine start. Car just started on its own. Getting out of that tight parking spot so I don't ding the door. And I swear to you, no one is inside of this vehicle. No one. <laughs> right now we are at the third and final experience here. This is all about level five autonomous driving. We can see that they've got the little course set up behind me. And this is interesting because theoretically in level five, you don't need a driver. You might not even need a steering wheel. So it's all how the car will, I guess, plan itself, how you can end up talking to the car. We're gonna go take a little test drive soon. So right now we're gonna have the car pick us up. Most of the time, most of the time. Where's my wife? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Arriving shortly. You guys can see the car. Coming to pick us up. No more walking. Oh no, what's oh, no. That's not me. Who's Carl? It's supposed to be, who is that? Carl with a K. <laughs> I tried to be English, but I first had it with K and I was no, here. Yeah, it's, K is it's German. Yeah. BMW got my name wrong. That, the, Sorry for that. All his fault. It's okay. And now we're getting in. Welcome. Personal co-pilot is ready to drive you. Enjoy the ride. And if you want, you can just start the ride because your only interface to the car is this touch screen here. Touch. You got it. Here we go. Oh my god. 
the car is moving on its own. And obviously you have a lot of spare time now. Oh, so beautiful. Now I can watch my movies. You can watch your movies, yes. you can hear music. If you want to pick up some stuff from your room and just get back again. So you can tell the car, okay, just stay close. Don't go, go that far away. Thank you. We're not done yet. We're not done yet. So BMW, you had to fix it, of course. Oh, look at that. Goodbye, Carl. With a K, you got it this time. So that is it, the entire BMW experience here at TED Times BMW. It's been awesome. The three experiences that I got to go to, I'm blown away by all the stuff coming. Obviously autonomous driving, work to be done on legislation. It's coming. It will definitely be the future. Interested to hear your guys' thoughts, leave them down below and I will catch you in one of my next episodes or in one of my vlogs. They also have an i8 Roadster in orange. They knew it was for me.